Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Gamery Den. So for today, we are going to be playing Timber Lodge. And, and this, uh, this is another PS... I believe the term is PS1. PS1? Give me a second. Let me not fudge this up. Okay, I'm back. It's PSX Horror Game. You know something that I have been noticing a lot on Itch.io that I owe? It's just PSX horror games are really, really fun to play. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to be fun for everybody, for, for, but for me, it is fun only because it has that old PlayStation feel. And I really do enjoy that. Kind of miss it. And it's really hilarious because I remember seeing this meme about, um, you know, you buy an expensive brand new computers for high definition graphics. And what do you play? PSX horror games. And they're the best. Let me tell you that. These are the best. Why? Because they don't freaking lag. Let me tell you something though. Back in my day. Oh God, I sound old. Oh God, I can't believe I said that. Oh God, it's come to that, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah it has. Anywho though, back in the day, they lag like crazy. Okay, let me tell you that. They lag like crazy. And now the fact that we don't get no lag, let us enjoy this, please. So. Without further ado, let's get started. Property of Firemore Police Department. The following footage depicts acts of violence, self-harm, and in relation to the case of the Crow Fetters cult. Any unsupervised viewing of this footage will be severely punished. Viewer discretion is advised. Now, here's something, just a little something, though, you know. Um, what are you playing? This is this is just out of context. What are you playing on YouTube? They you know, they're very serious about that um that word. So um I'm gonna be blocking it just so that way I don't get on the bad side. I hope so. Okay. Cap Crow Games present. Can I run? Oh, wait. I'm walking. So I just walked out of the t Timber Lodge Inn. Huh? Oh, okay, okay. Wait, where am I going? Twenty four FM. Okie doke. Hello, good sir. Hello, stranger. Name's Howard. My wife and child just abandoned me, claim I was an appropriate father figure. Just kidding. Anyway, welcome to our motel. Wow, dude. Um, uh, you, you want to talk about it? Uh, do you want to talk about it? Because that came out really strong. It was just like, uh, let me just say hi to you. And you're just like, hello, stranger. Name's Howard. Wife and child left me. Welcome. Oh, so you want to visit Fairmere and stay here for the night. Wonderful. Timber Lodge Inn is the best place for visitors. Also, you're in luck because tonight we don't have any other guests. Nice and creepy for ya. Is he moaning? Uh, dude, I don't feel comfortable with you moaning in my ear. No, thank you. Just pick up whatever key you want and go to your room. By the way, don't forget that if you need anything, you can come to me at any time. Ugh. I don't like the moaning. Um. Oh, looks like I grabbed lucky number five. Come on down. I thought I saw something for a second. Um. Okay. Okay, dokie. I just went to sleep just like that. Wait. I thought I gl I could glitch right through and see what's going on. Oh my god, who's having a party in the middle of my beauty nap? Let's just close the door.
Wait, what? Five, five, five. Um, dude, there's a lot of noises here, and uh, you're not here, are you? That's lovely. That's uh, freaking lovely. I love the car that's parked over there. So, what on earth am I doing now? There's a lot of noise. There's a beautiful symbol on the side of the store. I mean, and, and where the keys are. All doors are labeled five. Am I gonna get jump scared? Boo. I saw something here. Hello. Hello. Oh, what a lovely satanic symbol. Yep. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah, I'm just going to close that and I'm just going to go to the manager right now. Hey, uh, Fred. Fred Amingo. Compadre. Yeah. Yeah, that's how I'm going to complain. Hey. There was a, a really nice, lovely uh, symbol in uh, room five upstairs. Okay, remember room five uh, is going to be on the third, I think. Oh, wow. There's absolutely nothing in this. Uh... Wow. There's absolutely nothing in this floor. Um, um, I'm just going to go. And nothing happened at all. Oh! Okay, we found a book. I totally knew we had a flashlight with us. So, um, what's going on? Do I just check every single door, house? Uh, let me just open all the rooms and let me just, uh... Uh, so, um, I spawned in the back of the alley again. Well, not again, but, you know, I spawned. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Am I back in reality? Oh! There goes gravity. I just had to. I'm sorry. How do you everything okay? You look weird. Um, yeah. I think something's wrong. Uh, oh, she's still moaning. How did you find that book? Oh, well, I guess I have to tell you a little story. Many believe that Phil Moore is cursed. I know, right? Everyone wants a haunted town in their story. But not this time, son. Firemore is cursed. At least according to strangers. There are rumors of serial killers, ghosts, even aliens that are among us in this town. Hold that thought. If you ask me, that's a bunch of crap. Made up by my locals. We gotta make your town popular, am I right? And there's no bad popularity if you make your town famous. Now the thing is that all of this... All of this is true. Except the alien part. <laughs> I think... Anyway, Fire, Firemore has some kind of energy. Many claim that it's because of the magnetic forces or whatever. Is it me or is it getting way fuzzier? You can feel it once you enter it. The wind is heavy and suddenly you start hearing things. Things that you're not supposed to hear. Yeah, I couldn't stand it. I left Firemore and started a new business here. Outside of all this noise only way to fight it 
get religious. Just kidding. In the late 50s, there was a cult here, I believe, called the Crow Feathers or Salmon. Many believe that they are responsible for this mess. They were worshipping a demon like creature. I had two horns, I believe. They called it Ankoku, the demon of hatred. But what do I know? Anyway, I gotta work now. Get back to sleep and don't bother me again with all that. Alrighty, back to sleep. Wait, did I just... Oh, okay. So, room... Oh god, not another flight of stairs, please. Wait, can I shift to run? Oh, shift to run will be so lovely. Oh, ho, ho, I fell. I dumb fell. Hey, you! You're the one that drew those, uh, five, six, uh, six, 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 oh, help me. You're the one that drew that symbol, yeah. Oh god, he's right behind me, is here. Oh, that's the end of the recording. That's the end of the tape. Okay, I, there's no problem over here. You know, just a bunch of um, cults that are um, worshipping a hotel. Yeah. Really fine. Press E to enjoy. All right, everybody. So that is the end of the game. When you press E, it literally just um, kicks you right off to the screen. Well, not to the screen. It just kicks you off the game. I really do enjoy that game, though. However, I would love it if it had more lore if to the, you know, the hotel. You know, but you just can't be too hard on the game since it was made around in uh, four-ish days, is that? But yeah, if there was more lore, it would have been really, really cool. But yeah, I just kind of figured the cult just really loves the hotel and um, the motel, actually. And it provides excellent continental breakfast, I suppose. With sight of um, Five Stars Hotel. Anywho, that has been Timber Lodge Inn. I hope you enjoyed this game. And remember... The link will always be in the description down below. And I will catch you on the next episode. Catch you later, everyone.